Dégage. Um, downstairs in the car, I'm with my sister. Your sister? Yes. Yeah. That's the one that used to be a cop, right? Uh huh. So, she's not married yet, is she? Not yet. I doubt if any man wanted to marry a woman who could probably. So, here's the thing, I came home, I'm hungry, I've been working, guess what I found, there was no food. I'm not again, Josh. What use are you as my wife if you can't cook? I'm out there, slaving my nose, working my body to make life better for us, and yet you don't even have a single meal cooked for me when I get home. What use are you? Yeah. What use? Josh, I'm not your slave. Okay? Quit talking to me like a slave. You heard me. I'm not your slave. I'm your wife. I don't know if those people at work have been putting stuff in your head, but you're my wife. You serve me. What? Good are you if you can't cook me a single meal? Wait, do you know how to cook? Maybe all those meals I used to find when I get home, maybe you ordered them or something. Hmm. Okay. Just I'm really getting tired of all this. Stop treating me like your slave. If you wanna eat, I mean the kitchen is there. You can also cook. Yes, I'm talking to Josh, my husband. Yeah. Alright. Oh my god, what is that?
because I miss you. Jim, I don't think I can go on like this. I don't think I can do this again. Why not? Because I'm a married woman. You call that being you're married to a husband? He treats you like crap. What am I supposed to do? He's still my husband, Jim. Well, that's I will never treat you that way. I love you. I just, I just want us to be together. You can come and be with me. We can be together, Kelly. I love you. I would never treat you the way he does. Oh God, this is not easy on me. What is it, Kelly? Okay, Jim, I have to leave now. I'm sorry, I'm just so sick of this. I want us to be together. I can't... I can't keep on waiting for you. You have to make a decision. It's not possible, Jim. I can't leave my husband. Of course it is. People do it all the time. I can't take this anymore. 
It's torture. And even if you don't want to admit it, I know you love me too. Look, the only way you can ever be happy, the only way I can be happy is, is if we're together. Every moment I'm not with you, I feel so, so empty, so lost. You have to leave them so you can be so we can be together, so we can be happy, so you can be free. Aren't you tired of living in fear? No. Hurting the secret? Maybe you don't have to. What if there's a way that we can just get him out of the picture? Um, you mean like us running away to another state or something? I know it. He's my dream brother. He will find you. He will never. He will never let you be unless. Unless what? Unless he's dead. What? <laughs> Come on, Jim. No, that's. Just hear me out. If he's dead, you don't have to run away. You, you don't have to be afraid anymore. Don't you want to be with me? Don't you want to be free? Yeah, hey, he's my dream brother. I, he, he, I look like him. I mean, all will never know. No, Jim. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, it's just... It's gonna be a great idea if we take a vacation. 
it's kind of like a cruise. I mean, they have really nice hotels at the final destination, and it's lovely. I think it's going to be good for us. Like, you know, away from all the stress of work, all the stress of life, and just be alone and try to recapture those golden moments in the past, and try to build our relationship and make it lovely again. Like it used to be. So what do you think? It's not pretty. I guess, but it looks really expensive. That's fine, honey. I really think we can afford this, okay? If you really don't want to pay for it, it's fine. I have some money saved up and I can pay for it. So you have been hiding money from me? No. And now I, 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 you know, I think that this is good because now that's expensive and you want to pay for it. And we have all these bills and also you have all that money saved. I'm just saying, I mean, I can help you. That's a topic for another day. <sighs> so, why do you want to go on this cruise anyway? Just because I believe that we need to work on our relationship. We've been drifting apart over the past couple of years and I don't think it's healthy for our marriage. I really think we need to spend some time together and try to talk about things and, you know, try to make this work again. You know, I really think we need to open our relationship <laughs> and make it what it used to be. <laughs> Is it fun? <laughs> I uh, actually needed that. <laughs> All right, let me uh, let me just lay it straight for you. Um, we don't really have a relationship, okay? And to be honest, you're not not very good at being a wife. If uh, if. You were to leave me, um, if, no, God forbid, something would happen to me, I mean, God forbid, I don't think you can find anybody else to, uh, to marry you. You, yes, you really suck at being alive. And um, trying to take an ass on this cruise, try to make this better, it's, it's, it's not worth it. And um, let's just, I mean, it's okay now. Maybe like roommates, but that's fine. And uh, just, um, let's just keep things the way they are, okay? So, uh, you just uh, do your thing, and I do my thing. Everybody does their thing. It's a wonderful arrangement. Yes. So, don't embarrass yourself, okay? I'm sorry, honey, if I was to spend that much money on a cruise, I'd rather go by myself than go with you. Okay? I, uh, I'm, good. I'm gonna go to the room to continue reading my book, and um, it's a really good book, by the way, if you have a chance. Read it later, and uh, just still okay.
been having a lot of issues recently and um, I just want to make amends. I'm sorry. I want you to know how sorry I am. I'm deeply sorry. Um, well, I actually made one of your favorite food. Fries with chicken wings. A glass Look, of if you're doing this because you want something, I'm broke right now, right? You can't have it. No. I want to let you know how sorry I am. Really? Yes, honey, I'm so sorry. I want us to start over again. Believe me, I'm really sorry. Come on, let's sit down and eat. That's not good. Yeah. You sure you feeling okay? I'm fine. Why? Did you ask? I'm nothing. Okay, just. Just the way you like it. Sorry, George, come on. It's good. I told you. Now do you forgive me, Josh? I'll think about it. Oh, come on! I I really tried to make this work. Give me some. What's I didn't want to do this, but you pushed me to do this, Josh. Can I get some? I, I, I just wanted you to know that I really tried. 
I wanted us to be the couple we used to be when we started. When we first got married. But the more I tried, the more we frustrated my effort. I'm sorry, I didn't want to do this. I really want to do it. What did you do? I had to end it all. I'm sorry, Josh. I'm sorry, Josh. Forgive me. of his body and then I thought why don't I have a little fun by playing me and playing my brother 
<laughs> I pretended to be me. I pretended to be my brother. <laughs> so all that while you thought you were going to him, and him telling you he loves you, you feeling that you could kill me and go away with him. That was actually me. That was actually me. <laughs> I don't know why you didn't get into that car that day, but guess what, Kelly? I'm gonna make you wish you did. I'm gonna make you wish you were. Cause nobody leaves me. Do you understand? Nobody. <laughs> you planned the accident and I saw the wreck yes um, you may have utilized your mechanical skills in planning the accident and wrecking the car but the wreck took place close to where I live what? and I happen to I happen to be at the accident scene um, no longer after it happened. Your wife, my sister Kelly, 
was still alive then, what? but your twin brother was dead. And it's impossible. I was able to get out of the car. Josh, you killed my twin sister, you killed Kelly. I rescued Kelly from that accident, but Kelly died in my arms. My twin sister died in my arms. And Josh, I decided to... I, I decided to assume my identity. And... And... Kelly's dead. But... Josh, I'm going to revenge Kelly's death. No, Josh, I'm not Kelly. So now you can see how much of a big fool you are. Thinking I'm your wife, Kelly. No. I'm a twin sister. Because I hope if I want to kill you, I will avenge Kelly's death, Josh. So Kelly did die. That's it. That was clever. That was clever. But guess what? I'm gonna make you join your sister! <laughs>
How dare you? Kelly was my sister. My twin sister. She was all I had. She may not be perfect. But she was good. She has one of the best hearts in the world. She took Kelly away from me. My blood! Kelly was all I had. And now it's your turn to be taken away from the world. Oh, <laughs> 